Hey there, Sandrockers LMG here, and welcome back to my time at Sandrock. And as the Sandrock turns, oh, I think today we might be going to Sea Lab. We do have to make a drill arm first. Hopefully, the diagram is in our mailbox. Hi, right, Elsie. How are we doing this morning? How? Mm -hmm. Yeah, he is pretty strict Hi. about the Oasis. Yeah, you have a good one, Elsie. All right, from Chi. So now we have the power drill. Okay, we got that. Very nice. From City Hall. That's the 28th of the month is the Yak Mill Festival. The only festival actually during the fall. So it's a little bit of a dry spell. No, uh... Yeah, you did. Yeah, you keep doing that. If she wouldn't pursue her dream, that would be okay, too. I'm not... I'm not gonna try to... Tone down my romancing, everybody. Stick to the one. I do have that Nia, but thank you. Another letter? Oh, yeah. Tumbleweed standard. We didn't get out of that. All right. There we go. And I did get some scrap because I just, yeah, I figured less work for me, really. Okay. Merle, you guys eating okay? You know, I toss some sandberries in there. Enjoy. Magic mirror is somewhere. I don't know. That's all right. Commissions, though. Let's see. Chrome steel bars? I'll take it. Take that one, too. Ah, the other ones. Uh, we're probably okay. Tea leaves, I have quite a few. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. That's enough. I need a high-speed motor. So we gotta go to the Starship Ruins again. Ah, uh, alright. I can't get that anywhere else. Well, I say... Oh, go to school. We have to go to school, too. We'll do that. We'll go to school. I'll go get an engine, and then we can proceed. What's the price today? Zero percent, so... Not really worth buying or selling, really. Howdy, Vivi. Hello. Thank you. You're very welcome, Vivi. Very nice. Vivi's my good friend. All right. And no one should be in the blue moon by now, I'd assume. Actually, maybe not. I just noticed that because I saw the two arrows. Oh, he's coming though, I think. I got a feeling. Where did he leave his business open and unattended though? Hey, hey Jensen. Ah, thank you. Victoria, my dear. Howdy. What time I talk, my dear? I do gotta get to work. Heidi, all of this could have been yours. But alright. Merle, come on. Let's go get that. Hey, Professor Lou. What oh, is Sunday? Are more people going up? You know, I'm generally curious about the Thank Sunday you. attendance now. Because before, in our other earlier game, on our uh, save that was from early access, and two full release, uh, there was not a ton of people in here. But now Mian's here. Danby's here. I can't sit because I'm not allowed in here anymore. Uh, you all, I think you all know why. Okay, so... This Burgess doesn't, even though he's officially the pastor now, he doesn't show up to preach. Is this it? Just us two? So how you ladies doing? Thanks. 
Okay, well, Owen's here. That is something. How you doing, Owen? Yep. But so long, partner. Oh, wait, uh, recipe? Hmm. Hmm. Hey, Coop. Hi. <laughs> Take it easy. Man, it is really nice. So it's weird. There's more people now, but literally, usually Elsie showed up too, but Owen was stuck in the kitchen on our run. Mian never showed up. But Elsie isn't here. And I'm just going to stand on your head, Cooper. I hope you're okay with that. All right. So it is interesting. I don't think, uh, well, I'm sure, are you showing up too? No. Alright, fair enough. Uh... Yeah, let's go to school real quick. Get the Model Free Cities done. Even though it is Sunday, there shouldn't be school. Maybe it's Sunday school. Who knows? We're all waiting for you. Things are all set and ready to go. And look, here's a placard that you helped to make. Just hold it up for whoever you think is the best representative later. Welcome, parents and students. I apologize for the delay. I hope everyone is ready. The show is about to start. Please, find your place among the judges. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 15th Sandrock Mayor election. I'm your current Sandrock Mayor, Granny Jane. It's such a great feeling seeing so many young faces running for the next mayor today. That's not acting. She is Mayor Jane. As y'all can see, I'm getting too old for the role of mayor, and it's time for some new sapling to take over. I've witnessed Sand Rock's rapid development over the years, and everyone has been saying lately that we're the center of the alliance. Ahem. But I think our city still has the potential to grow even further in areas like entertainment, culture, and city development. That's exactly what I wanted to hear in today's campaign proposals. Four representatives from the Alliance Council are also invited to be the judges of this event. They are the clothing mogul, Grandma Vivi. Oh, hey everyone. I'm, I am clothing mogul Vivi, and I'd like to make clothes for people. Entertainment industry leader, Miss Katori. <laughs> Yep, better present some solid differentiation in your plans, or otherwise, I will not invest. Architecture and engineering mastermind, Miss Heidi. Hello, everyone. I hope you all do well. And finally, our biggest guest here today, Superstar Builder. Without a doubt. One of the best, if not the best builder across oh, the Oh, no, no, I am the best. Yeah. So without further ado... Let's welcome the first candidate, Miss Jasmine, to make her speech. <clears throat> Hi, everyone. My name is Jasmine, and I am running for the mayor of Sandrock. Once elected, I'll put more resources into the promotion of our town and the education sector. Sandrock has a fascinating history and loads of town folks. Yet it has not been properly marketed, in my opinion. My plan is to set up a publishing house in Martle Square and invite Mr. Ernie, I, I mean, Mr. Ernest, along with Mr. Owen, to write up a chronicle of Sandrock. That way, we can spread the word of Sandrock among the Alliance and let more people learn about the city's rich history and culture. Sounds like she's been learning from her mom. Now, wait just a darn moment. Are, are As Sandrock's really population increases, I'm also going to divide the school into kindergarten, grade school, and high school, so that students within the appropriate age group can receive the focus education that they deserve. 
Yeah, but you're all the same age almost right now. I, I, why would we have a high school for nobody? The plan will culminate in establishing a new university of higher learning right here in Sandrock, so that talented children don't have to leave anymore. Nice ideas, Jazz. That's all for me today. Thanks, everyone. Thank you, Miss Jasmine. Next up, we have our next candidate, Mr. Andy. Hey there, how y'all doing? My name is Andy, and I have a master plan for the future of Sandrock. Let's take a look, shall we? What in the yakmo is this? <clears throat> I'll set foot in the recreational business and revamp Sandrock into a giant theme park with attractions everywhere. Like the Yakmill Ranch? Let's make a Yakmill themed carousel called the Wheel of Yakmill. Now I get you, kid. After the revamp, the Martel Oasis will turn into a water park. Ideally, it'll be extended to the other side of the valley so we can design a waterfall. Let's call it the Desert Falls. Now that's a thought. Oh, don't give her ideas. Lastly, a handicraft paradise will be built next to the workshop of the builders so that they can teach these tourists how to make the best handicrafts. As for the stuff they make, they'll buy it for themselves. This kid's got talent. With a large theme park like this, it'll be mad not to have proper transportation. Look! I've designed this super steam mobile suit backpack so that people can get to places faster. Oh, too bad Cheese not here. So that's all for my plan. Thank y'all for listening. Vote for me and you get free water park tickets. And bribery. Oh, I like this kid. I, I do think his plan is a little bit more solid on the second playthrough. Thank you, Mr. Andy. So let's give a warm welcome to our last candidate, Mr. Pebbles. safe hands. So let's have our judges decide who's the best candidate. I didn't understand some of them, but I think Jasmine. Okay, ideas. one vote for Jasmine. Thought out, so I vote for her. Yes! I think Andy's ideas are a bit pie in the sky. However, it's not unreasonable, and it's opened up a lot of my mind. I'll vote for Andy. Well, Andy's idea is certainly thoughtful. I think some of the cost would be too much for Sandrock to handle. I think Pebble's idea is honestly not that bad. A more capable salvaging company would help our city. I guess I'll vote for Pebbles. Re really? Hattie the giant robots? How'd that even work? All right. I don't know whether I appreciate that comment or not. <laughs> uh, well, you know, uh... Katori voted for Andy, and we want to stand on our good side, so... Then Mr. Andy will win the race with two votes. Congratulations, Mr. Andy. You're now the newly elected mayor of Sandrock. Yeah, folks will live it up once I become the mayor. Oh, yeah, and free tickets to the water park. So that's it for today's Model Free Cities. Thanks to everyone again for tuning in. This is such a great activity. I've never seen these kids acting like this before. As a parent, I also find it quite interesting. Yep, all the kids are so motivated. I must say, this is a genius of an idea for Miss Jane. I didn't even get the idea at first, but I was fully immersed at the end. Today's event went well thanks to everyone's support, and I really appreciate it. Learning needs to be fun, and we hope to do more in the future. That'll be all. Have a good day, everyone. Whew. Did I look nervous? A little bit. Fortunately, the event ended in a blast. I felt like folks have now started to get my teaching style. That's such a weight off my mind. And it's all thanks to you. 
But I don't think you really taught these kids anything, though. You have been so helpful and caring since I came to Sandrock. I couldn't have done it without you. What is wrong with me? Oh! What does that mean? Of course, our relationships could grow even further. You're my first friend in Sandrock and will certainly be the best. And a swing and a miss. That's all for today. I haven't slept very much over the past few days, so I need to go catch some shut eye. See you later. Okay. All right. And uh, 300 gold. So I'll take it, I guess. All right. We are out of here. All right. So let's go get the high speed engine. All right, then we can get the mini drill going. Which is awesome. It's a really great thing for scavenging. I like it quite a bit. And later on, we'll be able to get a chainsaw, which is, oh, magnifique. I did not forget our quarrel, Thumper. Nice. That's actually from the first playthrough, but... All right, let's go. Hey, very nice. I think we can just reset this to where we were before. Yeah, can I just reset that again? Yeah, because that's where I got like three engines really quickly. So let's hope we get the same luck. Anything yet? Oh. I mean, that could be. Condensed power stones. Eh, all right. So this time, nothing on that side. All right. That's where I get a whole string of uh, explosives. <laughs> one, one high speed motor. That's all I wanted. Aha! There we go. And we are out of here. You're very good, and we're out. Then we'll be able to get over to the C lab. All right, Merle, let's go. What is this other side quest going on? Aid to Portia. Oh, okay. Oh, I think that was... Oh, hey, Zeke. I think that's way, actually. Now, why can't that builder over in Portia do it? I mean, they got Higgins. They're fine. Behind you. Behind you. I don't know, it's that way, actually. Ah, eh? oh, man. 
Mm -hmm. Oh, the Rogue Knight incident. Oh, yes, yes. Uh... Howdy. Oh, that Duvos. Mm. Aren't they awesome? continue that storyline sometime down the road maybe in the next game what their plans are for that mobile game next I haven't really heard too much about it uh -huh. uh, since the last playtest we did um. hmm? Ooh. don't get any ideas Heidi You know what? A giant boulder roll down would be pretty awesome. Hmm. Uh. Anyone sure would like that? Yeah, I don't want that Porsche builder to get famous, more famous than me. Hmm. Yeah. Uh. Uh-huh. Ha-ha. <laughs> hmm. Ah, uh, Coop. Mm. You. Okay, do you want me to really go do it? Ah, uh, true, it's for you, I will, though. Howdy. Mm. I guess so. All right. I suppose we can help out the second best builder in all the free cities. And get stuck in a sign. So let's go make a power drill. What do I need to get? That's a tumbleweed standard again. Oh, waiting for a letter. Okay, so that was not the letter. Hey, no problem. Got that done. Uh, let's refine that up. If we can, I'm not sure. I, I'm pretty sure we can. Right, you know, not terrible. I'll take it. I do have the weather forecasting chip. We should see her about that. I do also apologize. I know this inventory is terrible. Oh, man. If I could actually see... Well, probably just get... There we go. Oh, that's gonna be awesome. Magic Mirror, are you around here? There you go, Magic Mirror. How you doing, buddy? Do you also like weather well, forecasting chip? Yes. How much to do the weather? Of 
Or is that just automatic? I, I guess that's automatic. Okay, I won't worry then. What's the weather forecast? Sunny! Well, that's... that's I could do that, actually. Alright, so let's go to the meeting point. Be able to get this easy peasy. Now, this might be a little bit of a tougher fight. When I went this on the other run, I was level 70 plus. So, being level 46 with not the best gear. That tree is having a fun day over there. Wow, look at that. Okay, I probably should take these snakes out, though. Oh, and actually, we're going to get a... Oh, no, am I getting attacked during the event? Oh, you done with the drill? Nice. Barry's already gone ahead to turn <laughs> off the machine. Can you clear the path with the drill? I'll go fetch the assistant. Okay, I, this guy. Yeah. All right, almost there. Almost through. And done. Wow. Did you break all the boulders here? I'm way impressed. You're so cool. You know it. Oh, nice. The ruin is just a little up ahead. Ready to roll out? I'm ready. The headaches started a little beyond this point. But if Larry's done his job, it should be smooth sailing. Here goes nothing. Hey, let's rock. <sighs> Looks like Larry pulled it off. Come on. Hmm. Larry was supposed to have met us here. You don't suppose something happened to him, do you? I have a bad feeling about this. See if there's a way in. Look, there's a bunch of pipes over there. I reckon that's our ticket inside. Everyone, careful now. Nice. Well, it's called Lab 7. I've seen Lab, I think, from the uh, Adult Swim show. Uh, that's what I was thinking about. Larry? Larry! Larry! Come on. We've got to try something. Well, I thought it was hilarious. What are you talking about? Ooh, sand coral. Nice. No, okay, so we gotta go around another way. Oh, I didn't see that. My bad. Ooh, some rose stone. Nice. Oh, so we're a little under level. All right, nice. I'd prefer that, actually. Not that much of a challenge anyway, but... The water... Nano material. Wasn't that That's last Larry. Larry? Yeah, and he said Zena. That was his wife's name, wasn't it? Zena. Come on, no need to let anyone know we're here. Anyhow. We gotta go save Larry's hide. Let's see where this road leads us. Oh, look, and you're no fun. Come on, boys.
Okay, we're getting level 50. Very nice. Huh? Odd weather, all things considered. Well, it's fake. Clouds like that wouldn't just appear out of nowhere in Sandrock. It's gotta be simulated weather. Perhaps needed for some of the experiments they were doing? Wouldn't rule that out. No, wasn't this place meant to be deep in the ocean? Maybe it was for folks living here, in case they missed being up on the surface. Uh, sometimes these things remain a mystery. Let's press on. The whole fake sky dark room thing is giving me the creeps. Up yonder. That door looks as promising as any. Let's check it out. This one's actually four levels. This might be a little tougher. Oh. This might be actually one of the uh, creatures we'll be able to recruit as well in the upcoming pet DLC. Oh, garbage are fun. And done. I don't really need a feather duster though. Oh, in case we need it. Well, we got a vacuum cleaner. Look at that. More nano metal. Let's go. got a switch on it. My experience diving has taught me just to flip any switches I see and hope for the best. What's your take? Yeah, just flip it. Hmm. You don't suppose it could also have something to do with that weather simulation thing, do you? Well, only one way to find out. Okay. Well, after we loot some more, though. Oh, yes, we gotta go do every door. Another door lit up. Got it, no problem. Let's go get the power on this door. A dormitory? So these scientists live like students? Cables on the ground. It could lead to something. Yeah, so they're basically experimenting on lizards, and we can kind of see what happened. All right, another one up. Activated. Power restoration Ooh, halfway status. there. Fifty percent. Nice job done. We got chests over here. What do we got? Hey, 500 gold. All right. I'll take it. Restoration sequence activated. Power restoration. I'm pretty sure that's a voice actress for Heidi. Okay, well, one more door. Let's kind of get that bubble game that you get during the uh, day of memories. Huh. Oh, this is where we need the simple wire from. The other one is right here, actually. <laughs> and 
And done. Power restoration sequence. A lot of activated. plants, huh? This Power kind of life couldn't exist status. like this without something 100%. special going on. So this has got to be the right place. Exactly. Eagle Co. official leaflet? Nice! This counts as rare literature. All you did was fill in the form on the console? Cool! Let me get one too! Mm hmm. And. What? It says there are none left! Huh. What are the odds? Oh, take mine. Uh, really? I can just have it? Well, you can have it back whenever you need. I'll just keep it safe for now. Thanks. What a lovely souvenir to remember my first Sandrock adventure by. Ah, I don't, don't need it. I friendship up 10, though. Nice. System. Welcome to Gigo. Whoa, don't awesome. Don't anything. <laughs> Is this your first time down in one of these? Show's only just getting started. Is that so? Well, I'm looking forward to the next act, then. Yeah, well, path's clear. That's what you're gonna get. All right, let's go. I think we got him. There we go. Okay, it's power stones, more water. Very nice. Hey, let's stop here for a sec. Take a breather. Besides, I think it might be about time to talk about the elephant in the room. Oh, yeah. I reckon you're thinking the same thing. Larry lost all that weight. But it just doesn't look good. I was more referring to that elephant. Ah, oh, I see. Well, I stand by what I said. Huh, tell us how you really feel. But let's keep our eyes on the prize. Looks like two paths are ahead. Let's check that closed door first. It says two separate codes combined into a passcode required to open the administrative door. Oh, so close and yet so far. The algae is right behind this door. Passcode? Oh, shoot. We ain't got a clue. Let's look around. Maybe it's written somewhere around here. Well, it generally is, yeah. More sand coral over here, all right. No, let's not mash the keys and scream. <laughs> Hilarious as that is, it's not the right way to do it. They're putting chips in your brain. Lovely. I think I have anything else. Well, we've got something over here as well. It's just more sand coral. A little bit more work, but we got it. Hey, 
Hey, easy peasy. Check it out. Whoa, that's a lot of test tube things. Are we getting closer to the algae? Only one way to find out. We just break the glass and dive down? No? You guys are a little chunkier. We shouldn't open those. Can we get them all? All right, very nice. Declare in turn. Should we clean this out if we can? <laughs> Got it. What's too much over here? Uh, don't think. Do I? Well, might as well. I think we'll be fine either way. We do have in combat, okay. Uh, we don't have much left, actually. Oh, I mean, I can't really go wrong. I think maybe we'll do... You know, that's fine. Torn shield, why not? Uh, hybrid organisms? That basically covers everything. <sighs> I've never really put much thought into all that Church of Light doctrine about... How the people of the old world tried to play God. But seeing is believing. Jeez, I'm getting goosebumps. I've heard people talking about it before. But you're saying the Gieglers, the rat folks, the mole people, they're all made here? Maybe not here here, but yeah, definitely from some old world lab out there. Yeah, I guess it's not all bad. I always thought the mutant animals were due to the pollution and whatnot from the old world. I guess I knew nothing. Well, anyhow, we got the codes. Let's go. I hope Larry is okay. I'm sure Larry will be all right. Yeah, let's just head back up. But there's a chest, though. Oh, I can't leave that chest behind now. I saw it. Oh, two chests, actually. New furniture style, sure, I'll take it. All right, got him nice. Then we got somebody over here. Okay, got him. Just 
Just want the chest. Come on. Pretty chunky. Hey, you got another art masterpiece. Very nice. Okay, now we're totally done. Alright. Now we've got the code, so now we can go help out Larry. Okay, wow. All right. Guys, don't go in there. Just wait. Literally, it's going to take care of itself. That's all you had to do, guys. Have a nice day. A job done. Get this open. Hey, there we go. You actually get that from reading the books, but th that's fine too. Look inside. Who are they? Zena, Zena, babe. Why do you deny me so? I am the president now. As the most capable lady in our company, you should be with me. Forget about your former good-for-nothing husband. Gary! How can you say that? Larry lives. He's right there! <laughs> Is he? Well, that won't be for long. You've been holding out on me for way too long, my dear Z. Always saying Larry will be back. Too bad for you. I am in control now. And Larry, he comes back a traitor. Saying nonsense about the holy book is false. And the humans in Sandrock are not our enemies. Larry, cousin. It's hard to say this. But you're fired. Oh. No. You can take away his dignity. You'll always be a better leader than you ever be. You're nothing compared to him. Fine. Have it the hard way. I'll have you personally witness the end of my dear cousin for good. In the end, you don't get a choice. You will become mine. Then, together, we will finally conquer Sandrock. VP, managers. Do what you must do. I didn't expect to stumble upon an internal power struggle. Gary, I remember him, but he wasn't always this plump. We've got to hurry. I mean, or we could let this play out, guys. Uh, I mean, not really our. Oh, all right, fine. Might as well break some stuff. Oh, yeah, that's the one sentence he told us to say. I'll wash your mouth out, you filthy human. Reach for the sky, Gary. Come and make me, you small fry. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Oh. 
Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, just think about this. Good job, Larry. He totally meant to do that. No one can defeat me. You're all fired. Roro. And you won't get a single penny. Oh, he's back again, fully powered up. Why don't we check out the Giggler VP next? I'm sure Logan's got him. Oh, hi, boys. Talk about this. Ooh, Larry, anytime you want to get up, man. Hey, Zena, big fan. How you doing? Oh, well, yeah, yeah, all right. Oh, so many. Oh, they're so mad. Going down. Okay, nice. You and me, Gary. You can go hit uh, Logan as many times as you need to. You go ahead and hit me as many times as you need to. I am the president. Oh. Larry, are you okay? Zena. Husband, I'm all right. Oh, very nice. Well, good thing we got him when we did. Larry, you all right? I am, thanks to you all, Zena. I'm fine, husband. The president's wife isn't so fragile. Husband, I've been thinking about you every day. That despicable snake Gary kidnapped me. But now you're alive. Oh, Larry. Oh, Zena. <clears throat> so, uh, Nia, we came here on a mission. Ah, uh, right. I'm going to take some algae samples. But these machines look well preserved. I think we should salvage some of the core components. Might be useful if we want to cultivate this type of algae on our own. Can you help with the salvaging? Thanks. Okay, I kind of wanted to list, watch this romance for a while, but all right, all right. We're grabbing these, all right. 
mean, they were perfectly nice machines down there, but eh, all right, I'll take it. Have you finished? Great. Let's get back and show this to the professor and Mr. Zeke. Hopefully, this is what we're looking for. Hey, Larry. You coming? Huh? Oh. Hmm. I think I'll stay a while, yak boy human. I have to settle things with Gary and the company anyway. I'll come back when I'm done. All right, suit yourself. You ready to go? Yeah, I think we got everything. Let's go. That is quite some adventure. I'm glad Larry found his wife. Is he all right? Yeah, he said he'll be back soon. On the other hand, we got a pretty big payday. We found several types of algae. This is wonderful. I hope it wasn't too much trouble for you. It was fine. Nothing too stressful. Yeah, we all got out pretty unscathed. Even better. I take it you'll need to experiment a bit on the new algae? That's right. Time to prove our hypothesis. This is so exciting. We'll let you know when we get the results. Good or bad. I look forward to it. Thank you for your hard work. Hey, very nice. All right, level up. Logan's now my best friend. Okay. Howdy. Hmm. Yeah, very nice, yeah. Logan. That's actually everything done. Let's just head out. Quite a bit to get done in one day, but all right. Nia coming out, or? Yeah, it's weird, but all right. I guess we'll just head back. We can talk to her later. How we doing, uh, Jane? That you could, Jane. That you could. Oh, yeah, I was going to go over to the museum as well. We might have no time for that closes. We'll see. Mysterious man, I actually don't need anything today. I'm doing Katori. Ooh. Yeah, that would be a, a good idea. Finer. There's a couple things I did want to donate. Uh, yeah, a tip plant that uh, Jane keeps sending us would be good. I don't think I can, my uh, latest pick hammer, I don't think I can donate that though. For some reason they just, they don't want that. Alright. Any closer? Well, we're doing okay. I did get the 100 in the other playthrough, I'm probably not going to do it on this time. Alright, Merle, let's hit in. Guys, can I, can I get on my... Thank you. Alright, let's go. Lady Katori. I think we had a pretty good day. Merle, you decided maybe I might do some scrapping or scrap real quick. I don't think we did that the other day. Yeah, nothing we had there. You're not picking up stuff, Magic Mary. What, what are you doing? Did I miss something? Let's try that again. I think I was doing something and I 
messed up. I must have been looking at it. Yeah, you just do everything and I do nothing. Okay. I like that idea. I don't know if I said that right, though. Did I? Double check. No, the sign the other way. Uh, let's see. Well, then let's get out. I don't really need... That one. Yeah, I don't need party catering right now, really. I feel like collecting sand for machines would be good, though. Yeah, that's fine. I cleaned, yeah. We could get cultivated plants, I guess. Sure. Hey, there we go. I think I was looking and I must have screwed something up. Not finishing it. Alright, should be better now though. Just double check and see. Magic Mirror likes to let this run out anyway for some reason. And we'll refill it, but it likes to let it run out. But all right, uh, ladies and gentlemen, I think I will leave off here. Quite a long adventure we just had, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to hit that like button and tune in next time for another adventure in my time at Sandrock.